All right, welcome back to Seltzer Sunday, everybody. Oh. Chef Boy RV, other project. Pat. All Woo. right, everyone. Uh, we found this. They asked about it. The Mom Wad. The Mom Water by Mom Squad, everybody. Man, and we're here to deliver. That's right. So it's four flavors. Four. Uh, nothing new with that. Uh, but four and a half percent alcohol by volume. Okay. A little lighter. 90 calories. Uh, 90 calories. Okay. We got a coconut mango passion fruit, blueberry peach, and uh, lemon blueberry. Mmm. Uh, I think sound so. interesting. Simple. Mm-hmm. Flavors, too. Mmm. So. That's right. Uh, so we're going to dive into these and uh, see uh, if the mom squad is ready to meet Seltzer Sunday. Stay tuned. Let's ready? go. Let's do it. Let's go. All right, everybody. Welcome back to Seltzer Sunday. Chef Boy RV, other project, Pat. All right, we got this mom water uh, by the mom squad. Mom squad! Bring your brooms. Bring your vacuums. But today, today we're bringing you mom water. All yes. right. Chef Boy RV, everybody, this first flavor is the coconut mango. Mmm, interesting combo. Again, this is fruit-infused vodka water, so uh, a little bit. Expect zero carbonation, and you see us pulling it, zero bubbles. Oh, okay. So I think that's important to think about. And we're having this on the rocks. That's right. Testing it out. I don't think we've had a coconut mango. Have we had coconut mango before as a combination? I'm trying to think. The uh, Malibu one. Ah, that, that, that was absolutely. coconut mango? Yeah, I think so. Mm, I guess I repressed it. Yeah, same. Wow. <laughs> mm. This one, it's it's all right. Yeah, uh, taste-wise, it's there. It tastes like coconut mango. I mean, not really getting much mango, though. I, I definitely mm. more on the coconut side. Yep. Um, it, it's pretty light. Yeah. Uh, it's not wowing me. Nope. What do you think, 6.5? Yeah. Six five, okay. Now aftertaste, uh, it's getting any anything. Uh, like I'm, I'm getting a little mango. Yeah, mostly water, mostly a watery aftertaste, which is okay. Mm -hmm. Cleanse the palate for the next one. Yeah. Um. So put up there, give a seven. You know, seven right in the middle. Yeah, right in the middle. Not trying to show off. <laughs> not trying to show. I like that. Now quantity, I think it's gonna get filling. It will. Yeah, I, I think uh, it's gonna be filling. Not gonna be in the mood for more, that many more. Nope. Four or five. Yep. It's gonna give us a six. Unfortunately, <laughs> yep, that's a six. Uh, not the best start, but hey, there's three more, and we're here to tell you all about them. Let's go. All right, welcome back, Seltzer Sunday. Here we got the Mom Water by Mom mm, Squad. Mm, mm. Uh, we did the first one, the Coconut Mango, Sandy. Oh, Sandy. Sandy off stage two. She first. was a six. <laughs> All right, <laughs> next up on stage, Julie. Let's give it up for Julie. Right. Passion yeah. fruit. Let's go, Julie. And by that, we mean the names that are on here. Yes. So we have a uh, coconut mango is Sandy. Passion fruit is Julie. And blueberry peach, Linda. And then lemon blueberry, Karen. Karen. How'd she, how'd she make the cut? Hmm. All right. Passion fruit time. All right, here it is, y'all. Again, 90 calories. This is a, a, a fruit-infused vodka water. Yeah, I think the last time we just had where it was just passion fruit by itself was uh, the Malibu. Yes. And uh, that one we gave a 6-1. Yeah, so hopefully we got good high hopes to, that we can be better uh, than Malibu Mom Squad. Mm-hmm, let's see. All right. Because we've got high hopes. High apple pie in the sky. All right, um, Chef RV, thinking about taste wise, mm. uh, tastes like water, which is not bad. But I'm not really getting not any really passion fruit at all. all. It's, it's very like, light. It's a lot. Li it's like almost as light as like no, it's, it's lighter than a Propel. Like you gave it a Propel. Oh, uh, so good that, call. Yeah, I'm not mad at it though. No. Not that there's anything wrong with it. So, I mean, taste-wise, there's not really a taste it's not there. Not much to taste. It's a 6.0? Yep. Yeah. I mean, aftertaste, it's, I think with this with this drink, cold is key. Yep. You gotta have it on the rocks, just or fresh out. Cold. Yeah, yep. ice cold, just fresh out the cooler. Um, it, yeah, it's refreshing. Yep. There's no, not really a taste there. So it's kind of like uh, having a nice cold water. Yep, that's true. 
say just right in the middle, 7.0. Yeah. Okay, 7.0. Now that being said, there's no taste. Yeah. There's no aftertaste. No. You could pound these away. I mean, you could have a lot of these, yep. which, and that being said, it's sneaky good. Yeah. So Watch be out. careful with those. I mean, Watch they're going to catch up to you. But yeah, you could pound a lot of these. I mean, it's very light. Mm -hmm. What do you think of a score for this one? Oh, um, nine. Nine? You could have yeah. nine of these for sure. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah, and you're going to feel it in 20 minutes. But uh, that gives us a 7.3 of the project. All right, all right. Uh, redeemed ourselves from the coconut. Mango, uh, Bravo, right. Passion Fruit, Bravo, right. Lindo, right. some Julie, some previous um, brands too. So we're going to the next one. Let's go to Linda's house. Let's go. He's ready. We're ready. Let's go. So Sunday, we got this third flavor here. Uh, my mom water. This is the blueberry peach. Everybody, blueberry peach made by Linda. Now usually uh, blueberry, it's pretty tart. That's right. Uh, combo. I, I I get pretty hesitant with it. And then you're combining it with peach, you know, yeah. just in the past, you know, peach hasn't been a very no. good combo overall. There have been some yeah. good ones, but majority have not been so good. And the standalone peach is not very good. No, ladies and gentlemen, nope. it, it's not. But that being said, there is no carbonation in this. So, and I think we should find out. Let's find out. Sorry for the random long pause there. <laughs> I didn't know what I was thinking. Mm. That's the problem I wasn't. All right, Chef Boy, we, um, I think we finally found the balance of, uh, of peach and blueberry. Yeah, it, it, um, it's very light on the blueberry, which is good. Yep. Not a sense of tartness at nope. all. Um, I think I'm noticing um, a theme here of light and refreshing. That's right. With, with this kind of, I mean, it's, it's really good. O uh, overall, these are pretty decent, I'd yeah. say, so far. I haven't had the last one, but man, I, I, I'm not mad at this at all. No. I, it's a light blueberry with maybe a little Just bit a of peach. peach. Yeah. A little bit, but that's at the yeah. aftertaste, but we'll very, get to that. Yeah, very end of it. Um, I mean, I'm a sucker for blueberry yeah. muffins and yeah, stuff, like a, this, so. This smells like a blueberry yeah. muffin. Yeah, a little bit, but yeah, but it's light. Yeah. So, taste-wise, seven five. Yeah, that's right. All seven right. five. Now, aftertaste. Uh, uh, I think that's where we're getting the peach that's where in. Peach comes in. Yeah. Uh, Linda makes a good blueberry peach. Um, Cobbler. Yeah. So, uh, what do you think for the aftertaste? Uh, it's it's a. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's the best one yet. Yeah, I, 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 it's a it's a nice blueberry flavored with a well, light blueberry, but a little bit more of the peach. Right. I'm not mad at it. So, so that's seven eight. Seven eight. Yep. Uh, how many could you could you have of these? I could have a good amount. Uh, I think I could have a little bit more of the passion fruit. That's right. But I can definitely have more of these than the coconut mango. Probably giving it an 8.0 just because it's it's pretty light as yeah. well, light and refreshing. Going to bring these on a tailgate, they're going to go away pretty quick. That's right. So 8.0 that gives us a 7.6 on uh -huh. the project. Right. Pat. Hey, uh, still um, getting better each time. Uh, we got one more though. One more. Let's go. All right. All right, Pilgrim. These seltzers aren't going to review themselves. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to finish off here with this uh, Lemon Blueberry by Karen. Karen! Yeah, we just chatted with our managers here at Seltzer Sunday, and Karen approves of this. Matchy man. All right. All right, we're going to try this little Lemon Blueberry here. That's right. All, all right, right, Karen. Let's see what your mom wanders all about, eh? Well, other project path, I think, on the rocks is the way to go with these. Yep. Or chilled as possible. Yep. Chilled is key. That's right. With the mom squad. Taste? Taste? Uh, I think it's it's almost, almost there. there. Almost there. I like it better than the coconut mango. That's right. That's right. And I like the taste. Well, well of course, it's better than the passion fruit. There's not really a taste there. <laughs> but... Uh, Six nine? I think it's six nine, yeah. Alright. 
Aftertaste wise, give me your thoughts on the Project Pat. Um, it's better than the first two. Uh, probably just because uh, the passion fruit doesn't really have much of a taste. <laughs> uh, the coconut mango is just, I don't know, it's going to start getting a little filling. So mm -hmm. I give him the 7 2 on this. 7 2, he says. You heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. Now the quantity. How many can we have? Um, I'll uh, have more than the coconut mango. That's more, but uh, I think the, uh, the the second and third is. Yeah, the, that passion fruit, you just. It all, that one wins for the quantity today. Uh -huh. I mean, you, you, there's no taste, so you can just, yep. it's like drinking water, but That's be right. careful. Um, that blueberry peach, that was just pretty darn good yeah. taste-wise yeah. and stuff. I think with that quantity, you're going to have a good amount as well. That's right. This one, I'd say a six. Yeah. A six. You, you're going to have one and then see what else is there, yeah. and then you, you might go back to That's it. That's right. You might go back to it. So that gives us... Six, seven, two, six, nine. That gives us a six point seven of the project right. map. Doesn't quite make the cut, but um, you know, hey, we are here to try it for you. Yes, indeed. You heard it here first. All right, it's time to go to the outro. Outro time. All right, everybody. Uh, hope you're having a happy Seltzer Sunday. This is with Mom Water, and we met the Mom Squad. Uh, Mom Squad. Clear winner today is the. Uh, Blueberry Peach by Linda. Congratulations, Linda. With a 7.6. That's right. Uh, Linda, 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 please pass, sing. Passion fruit was okay as well. Um, I think overall I would want to give this a try. Mm -hmm. um, Worth it, the purchase. It is, uh, they're all light and refreshing, uh, but the flavors didn't all really make it tough. Mm -mm. I believe it was about 2 out of two out of 4. That's right. 2 out of 4, so, 50%. Yeah. Well, um, yeah, um, I think if you're looking for a lighter, lighter alternative and want to skip the carbonation, go with these. <clears throat> I couldn't have said it better myself. And now to that time of the show, ladies and gentlemen, where Patrick and I are going to do the Suicide Seltzer. We are going to play rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three, and shoot. The loser has to take the Suicide Seltzer. All right, it's a combination of all four flavors. All right, let's go. One, One, two, three, shoot! Dang it! Oh! <laughs> oh. I should have yeed when I hauled. <laughs> All right, everybody. Um, again, uh, other project packs at YMB. We're on uh, Instagram, Real Seltzer Sunday. You choose the Real Seltzer Sunday. Uh, follow, like, subscribe. Uh, give us your uh, thoughts and recommendations for the next one. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. How was that one? Dude, it was uh, light and refreshing. Hey, you got it. You heard it here first, Mom Squad. See ya!